My educational background consists of high school. After high school, I went on to college four years as a pre-med major, biology major, and from there I applied to medical school. I was accepted into Columbia University College of Physicians and Surgeons, and that's when I did four years in medical school. During those four years, you get a chance to be exposed to the different aspects of medicine, and you begin to see what you like and what you dislike, what you want to gravitate to, um, and you, you are given an opportunity to then decide uh, what you want to do for the rest of your life. For me, my interest has sort of sparked. I know I wanted to be a physician. I initially, my thoughts were that I would be a pediatrician because that was the person I knew, my pediatrician. I love taking care of kids. But in my first year of medical school, I think gross anatomy was quite a turn on. And the, the ability to dissect out a body, to see how it works, to understand the intricacies of the various organs and the bones and the muscles was very intriguing to me. And that, I think that, that first semester of gross anatomy did it for me. And I wanted to be a surgeon after that. And so surgery seemed to be my calling. I also like kids. And so I sort of in my mind thought pediatric surgery would be a great avenue. And I went on to my internship and residency at Harlem Hospital Center in New York City with a focus on surgery and was introduced to pediatric surgery. Fortunately, the, one of the very first female attendants that I met was a pediatric surgeon. And so I wanted to be just like her. This was the lady who I idolized, she was it for me, she was very kind to her patients, she operated on these kids with a finesse that was remarkable, and so I wanted to be just like Barbara Barlow, she was my idol. And, um, and so my quest was, in my journey, was really to do pediatric surgery. And five years of general surgery training with a focus towards pediatric surgery, and I then applied for a fellowship in pediatric surgery and realized that I needed research time in order to be better qualified to be competitive. So I ended up going to University of Pittsburgh to do a research fellowship year, two years of research to make myself better qualified to be a pediatric surgeon. And those two years of research were supposedly in transplantation. And so my two years in transplantation fellowship post general surgery got me hooked into transplant. So that's how I ended up being a transplant surgeon.